Hey guys, how's it going? Are you looking to take your content to the next level? Well, you've come to the right place. In this video, I'm going to show you step by step on how to live stream on YouTube. Okay, first things first, log into your YouTube account. You're going to see this camera icon in the top right hand corner. A drop down will appear. Click go live. In the next window, it's going to ask you if you want to live stream right now or at a later date. And I'm going to be clicking a later date because I'm already using my camera to record this video. Next, it will ask you if you want to use your built in webcam or a streaming software so you can add overlays and new graphics and stuff like that. I'm going to be clicking built in webcam. Camera cannot be accessed because it's being used by another application, obviously. So I'm going to just click stream. First things first, obviously you can title your video here, pick the category, either make it a public or a private, or I believe you can live stream to your subscribers only. Here you're going to be setting up your stream key. So you can pick here and then basically here's your key. So you're going to be copying this and I use OBS Studio. So I'll be going into OBS Studio, copying it and pasting it into the stream key your URL, your backup server URL. Here's your stream latency. What stream latency is the delay between what your camera captures and when it's shown to your viewers. Based on what you wanna do, you can click on whatever one you prefer. Here's enable DVR 360 video, just in case you're like outside with a 360 cam hiking or something like that on live stream. Here's the delay. This is so your chat can be delayed so you can read it better. Closed captions, if you want those on, unlist live replay once stream ends. You can click this and your viewers won't be able to see that live stream video after you end the live stream. Now I'm not able to view this right now, but when you click this webcam area, it will also ask you for a title, description, how you want to go live so you can click what webcam you have just in case you're using a DSLR camera. Category again, come over to manage. And right now there's nothing to manage because you're a new streamer. Now what I'm going to do is take you over to OBS Studios and show you how to insert your stream key. Okay, so in OBS Studios, I'm going to come down here to the bottom right, click settings, click stream, and you have to connect your account. So you can do this whether you're live streaming on Twitch or YouTube, but let's connect my YouTube account. And then right here is where you paste your stream key and then you're all set up and good to go. You have to use your stream key first and then connect your account. Let's connect my account right now and I'll show you why I say that. So I connected my account and the stream key just disappeared. So just make sure you do that. And a common problem that people run into is when you try connecting your account, whether it's Twitch or YouTube, sometimes it says couldn't get channel information. So make sure that your OBS first of all is updated Go up to help, check for updates. No, no updates are currently available. So if you're having an issue with connecting your Twitch or YouTube account, make sure it's updated all the way. Make sure you're also using the right emails on your accounts or else it will say you couldn't connect because I actually ran into that issue. I was using an email that I thought was on my YouTube account, but I had a different Gmail account associated with it. So there you go guys, I showed you how to set it up on YouTube and how to connect it to your OBS account so you can manage everything. All you have to do is make sure your microphone and your webcam are set up properly. So that's gonna wrap it up for today's video. Make sure you like and subscribe. Leave a comment below in case you need any other tutorials. Hope you guys all have a great day and peace out.